it's fine. So this is our silver penciled rock. I was just going to tell you about the rock breed in general. They're very good layers. Now I have a partridge rock and a silver penciled rock. Those are the two varieties and those ones make fantastic showbirds. Both of them have done really well for the kids in 4-H. This bird took grand champion bird at the entire show. She's a pullet. As you can see, she's not super friendly. She's actually kind of reclusive and shy. So I have both extremes. The other rock I have is a bully. But they are gorgeous birds and good layers, so I kind of keep one or two in the flock just because they do well for the kids at show and they're good layers, but... She's lower on the pecking order. She just as soon walk away. She's kind of the last to come for treats. This is my other rock, and she's a partridge rock. And she is gorgeous. And a year ago at the fair, before we got the silver penciled rock, she took Grand Champion Standard at the fair. And, I don't know if you can see, she's wearing bully glasses, I call them. The penless peepers. Because she is just a bully. Normally, there's a reason for chicken's aggression and there's, you know, predictable behavior. <laughs> Not her. No threat or anything involved. She'll just run over if anyone's in beak's range and rip out a beak full of feathers. So that is why she has earned the privilege of wearing these glasses. And I keep telling her, I'm going to eat you. Aside from being gorgeous, she kind of annoys me because she picks on everybody. So she's not really one of my favorites. She is a decent layer though. The pinless peepers really have curbed her attacking for the most part. I'd say by about 99% and made her tolerable. And she'll still attempt to attack, but a lot less frequently because she's not successful. <laughs> and the birds have time to get away from her now because she just, she can't adjust her attack. She has to attack blindly, and so they do work. So those are the two rocks that I have. One is shy and reclusive, and the other one is a bully. So I'm not crazy about them, because they really aren't, I like friendly, you know, personable birds. Like they'll come running for treats and stuff, but they're not fond of human interaction. They don't really want to be touched or picked up for the most part that way, which aside from being beautiful and good layers, if that's what you want, then they're fine. And they get along okay in the flock. Well, that's the scoop on my birds. And the birds are getting smart. They're figuring out to jump in the tree and get all this fruit. See these little olives? They love them, and so do the wild birds. I heard all the squawking, and the Dominique was the first one to figure it out. I'm surprised they're big. They're determined to get in here because they're big birds. Oh my goodness. I didn't know the partridge rock was capable of that. She's like cardboard personality. Everybody else is jealous. All right, you got to see Penny because Penny here, Penny. <clears throat> so now watch Penny, because she has the penless peeper, so she can't just directly look and eat. She has to like do a triple take and then guess where the fruit is. It's hysterical. She's figured it out pretty good. peeper doesn't stop them from doing anything. It just kind of helps with the bullying. Too funny. <laughs> Got my turkey hens jumping up to get the berries. Put the chairs here so they could climb up and get them. <laughs> 